everybody, Jason from Hollis Farm. Back on the 5065 with the grass cutter hooked up. Got a couple of projects this morning. We've got the grass around the barn here. And then I'm gonna go up to uh, where we're gonna start logging. And I gotta I'll show y'all where we're gonna start. And I got a road that I've gotta cut. And I'm gonna tell y'all why we're gonna do that. But anyway, let's get going. Alright, so I'm up here where we are going to start logging this year. This up here gets drier quicker than anything. So if we got a project to do this up here, this is where we start. Let me turn y'all around. Alright, so this strip down through here got thinned, I don't know, five, six years ago. And also this. And these trees have gotten so big, they're just about to get out of our market that we like to stay in. So this str long strip down through here... We're going to clear cut it and get it back ready to replant and start over again. Really big trees. When they get on the ground, you'll really see how big they are. And then there's a strip down through here. I'm going to make two blocks right here. This block right here is going to go a pretty long way that way. So we're going to have a clear cut right there and a clear cut down through here. These will stay a little bit. And then down on the other side, I'll try to show you all on the way out. I don't want to bush hold me a lane there too, but uh, we got a clear cut on the other side of this. But this right here is like an old skid trail, old road, like we've been trying to keep up. So I'm going to bush hog this, and then uh, that's going to be my fire lane from here on out. I'm going to make these sections where it's real easy for one person to burn. Got the main road right here, and we've got a property line road on that side that we can use, grade up, whatever we need to do, this for a fire lane there, and then we've got a main road out there. So this is going to be the only one that we kind of have to deal with as far as disking or grading or whatever to uh, for the fire lane. So I'm going to try to bush hog it as wide as I can. I come down here yesterday or the day before, and there was a couple of little wet spots, but um, we missed the rain last night that, that uh, came through, thank goodness. So uh, hopefully we can get started logging in the next few days week two whatever it's gonna be but i want to get this cut now before they get here
right, so this right here is about a three-year-old clear cut. Boy, it looks good. And then we got a patch of trees, and then we're gonna clear cut over there where uh, we were just push off. And I'm just gonna make one round around this right now, kind of look at it. I've been keeping it up. Got my mind on planting clover on this long lane all the way around this clear cut. I just hadn't done it yet. I do that this fall, but man, the brush deer is used in that right now. Looking good. y'all not a super big project today but a couple of little projects that needed to be done man i'm ready to start logging them always seems like it takes forever to get started because it takes so long to dry but we are very close especially if we can dodge some of these uh showers we dodged a good one last night it, uh, it don't look like it hardly rained any down there we needed that but anyway see what happens next time appreciate y'all watching out of here